What's going on everybody? So today I'm going to show you how to set up a viewer counter for when you're streaming over on Kick. And to be able to do that, you're going to be using Botrix. So I'm going to throw the link in the video description below for you. But once you're logged into it, you're going to go to widgets, viewer counters or viewers counter, and you're going to see something like this. So you have your background, opacity, color, and your font, your typography. So for the background here, we can change it to whatever color we want. I'm just going to choose a random color here. Now your opacity, this is at about 50% here, so it's semi-see-through. If you bring it all the way up to 100, bringing it all the way to the right, it's gonna make it a solid color. If you bring it more towards the left, it's gonna start making it more see-through. If you don't want to have a background at all, just bring that slider all the way to the left and it will get rid of it completely. I'm gonna bring it up just a little bit so we have some color. Now for your font color, you can change this as well to whatever you want. So let's just choose like, a dark purple, I guess. I don't know. Now we'll, let's go with something a little bit brighter. Let's go with the yellow. So then you also have your fonts as well. There's not a lot of fonts to choose from, but it does give you something. So I'm just gonna choose a random one here. And once you're satisfied with how this looks, just go here, click on copy, and it's gonna copy it right to your clipboard. And then we're gonna go to OBS. I'm gonna delete this one that I have. We're gonna click on the plus inside our sources, go to browser. And we're just gonna paste that link right in here and hit okay. So now we're just gonna bring this a little bit higher so you guys can see it. But that is pretty much it. But yeah, that's pretty much how you create a viewer counter. You can move it around anywhere on the screen. You can resize it however you want. And that way people can see how many people are watching or if you wanna see how many people are watching and stuff like that. So it's a useful tool. Um, if you did find this stuff helpful or if you are wanting to learn how to get everything ready for you to stream over on kick make sure you take a look at the playlist here on the screen and there's always new stuff being added to it and also be sure to subscribe to the channel for more tutorials to help you guys with streaming and understanding kick and everything like that and if you want to follow me over on kick as well the link's going to be in the video description below or you can just look up creobox over on kick and you can follow me over there as well but thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next one take care